Hi, my name is Brian and I'm the 3D print creator. When you live in the Netherlands like I do, you can't use radar detectors in your car because this is prohibited by law. Having a radar detector can really get you into trouble because not only can you get a big fine for it, but also the Dutch police cars are equipped with detectors that can detect a radar detector. Therefore, if you own a radar detector and you have it turned on, the chances of getting caught are well, almost 100%. Now, telling people where police radars and speed traps are is not prohibited by law and therefore people use software and GPS equipment to notify each other and get notified by others. This can be done with software like Waze or with specialized software called Flitsmeister. In my car I use Flitsmeister to tell me where the speed traps are and to notify other people. But there is a second problem. Flitsmeister is an app that runs on Android or iOS devices and in the Netherlands it's not allowed to touch your phone while driving. Pushing the notification button on the screen of your phone to warn other cars with people using Flitsmeister is therefore illegal and can get you in trouble, resulting in an even bigger fine. The Dutch company Flitsmeister therefore made a small piece of hardware that you can put in your car that connects to your phone via Bluetooth and well this device called the FM2 or Flitsmeister 2 uses a buzzer and a screen to show you the allowed speed and to warn you for all kinds of things like traffic jams, accidents, upcoming ambulances, fire trucks, police cars and well of course speed traps. The device has two buttons and touching it while driving is not specifically mentioned as illegal and therefore it's allowed. Now the original brackets to place this device in your car, they are designed by, well let's say someone who was not the brightest bulb in the pack. The device has a USB port to charge the unit and its software is programmed to automatically turn on when there is power on that USB cable, yet with the provided holder you can impossibly use the USB connector because the device leans on this connector. Therefore, well, I just had to design another bracket, one that could be mounted on a place where it's inside while driving and where I can reach it with my hand to notify people of upcoming danger or speed traps. A bracket that I 3D printed with my longer orange 4K resin printer and ABS like plastic that is both ultraviolet and heat resistant. Now I can drive my car without the stress of getting a speeding ticket for exceeding the speed limit with well a few kilometers per hour. Let's keep it that way. Thanks for watching this video and if you liked it please give the video a thumbs up and if you like my content maybe you should subscribe to this channel and hit that notification bell to get notified whenever I publish a new video, just like the notifications for speed traps. Okay, this is it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys and girls later. Bye!